Hey everyone, it's great to see you. I wanted to give you an update on my bag in a pot in a pot method that I've been using and you've been following me noticing that I have my hydrangeas in the bag in the pot and then all these beautiful gap flowers around it. A lot of my hydrangeas are starting to look past a little bit. So of course I want to keep babying them along. However, if I really want a spectacular pot that now is going to go into the fall, I have the great opportunity of being able to remove my hydrangeas put them somewhere that they're gonna get exactly what they need, their water and their sun to make good buds for next year, and replace them with something that will go into October here. So all I have to do is remove the bag. And that's really easy to lift out. A Couple weeks ago, you saw me put together these new bags with these beautiful coleus that I have, some potato vine, and these are great for going right to the first frost. So all I have to do is add this in. And now I have my new look for the fall. So this bag in a pot in a pot method is just saving me so much time and keeping my planters just looking in their prime all the time. And that right? So thanks so much for joining me. I'd love to hear how your bag in a pot in a pot plants are doing. Please drop me a comment below and I'll see you in the next video.